Where's that hecking on button? Oh, I found it! Let's play! Good evening everybody, Luke here with the Meditations launch on today, Friday, October the 4th, 2019, and today's meditation offering is created by Ian Martin, with the blurb being as such. Something really bad happened in the summer of 2013. A few months later, I took a bus to Toronto. I met an internet friend for the first time. She told me I was taller than she thought. Her dad bought us A&W. My friend told me NASA was going to prove we lived in a simulation. Then we saw a concert together. I stayed with a different friend from high school. All night I felt the simulation exploding around me. The next day, I took the bus home. I'm not quite sure what form this meditation is going to take. Because this sounds like a sad story, but it also sounds like an intriguing story indeed. Because the something that bad happened in 2013, that just simply because that is saying something really bad happened, it is alluding to something horrific. But then the fact that they are hanging out with friends and that they're having those connections, is them making for a, a happier ending? I'm not quite sure. This seems like it's going to be a rather bittersweet meditation just from the blurb alone. But I may or may not be right about that. So let's see how today's meditation does indeed reflect upon the topic of the blurb on today, Friday, October the 4th, 2019. Okay, and this game has just opened up with the title being Ian Martin, the creator's name. And as you can indeed see in front of you right now, we have the name of the creator as well, Ian Martin. So I have just hit the arrow keys and we are on a bus. But on a bus and... <gasps> Daddy Kitty Cat! I gotta go meet the kitty cat. How do I go meet the kitty cat? <gasps> That's me! I can go see the kitty cat! Hello kitty cat, you're adorable. You adorable little pixely kitty cat. So cute. And now... Where are we? With a friend and... Her dad? Perhaps? The blurb did mention that we were seeing... An internet friend. I'm, I'll be quite honest, I'm not sure what A&W is. I am not quite sure... And now we're surrounded by people on chairs? I want to say while it's raining. Because this was the same graphic that was used for chairs on the bus that we took down. Could this be the concert? We're surrounded by people on the concert and the stage is in front of us. Perhaps? I'm not quite sure. And then, yes, it did mention that we were indeed spending a night with a friend as well. Spending a night with a friend. Yes. Hello. 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 <laughs> and I'm guessing this is our bed here. Because we can't, we can't go on to this bed here. So, this is our bed. We sleep. We sleep. And the universe explodes around us. <laughs> Bright and colourful indeed. Hello. Everything is around us. Everything. And then... We have the journey back, but there's no one to journey with us. And that is the meditation. Just retelling the story. And that is the meditation, just retelling the story of the blurb. The meditation may have mentioned what the bad thing was that did indeed happen in 2013, but my interpretations weren't really that good for the beginnings of the meditation, just because straight away I saw that we were on the bus, so at some point during the meditation it may have alluded to that, but because as part of the meditation's like description words and uh, sentences aren't really supposed to be part of the meditation, so you do have to take away inferences from it. And from what I took, 
it followed the blurb pretty well. It it mentioned about going into Toronto by the bus, meeting the internet friend. I think the bit where it was raining was A and W was is A and W a band? I'm not I'm not sure. I I'm, I'm I'm really not sure. My apologies for that. But then we did indeed see a friend in the universe that explode around us, as our mind did become aware of everything. Everything is a scary concept, because it's the opposite of nothing. And you can't comprehend nothing, therefore how can you comprehend everything? Oh no, my brain may burst. Scary. Very scary indeed. I'm a fan of this meditation. I don't know why. It's rather simple, there's no music, but it just seems to be connecting with me on some deeper level and I'm gonna have to process why I'll be honest when I jump into these meditations I, I don't have all the answers I don't have all the answers in the slightest I just experience the meditation and recall my experience but for this one I'm afraid I don't really know what happened I just know that I'm all the better for having experienced it. And I suppose that's all you can ask from a meditation, just the experience and understanding that you may or may not develop along the way. I've enjoyed this meditation, and I recommend you go and experience it yourself, but unfortunately, it does indeed come to that shill 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 bit of this meditation. If you did enjoy it, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If not, that is perfectly fine as well. Those sorts of things can go and not understand everything in the world because you can't understand everything that's just a simple fact you cannot understand everything but yes thank you so much for watching our videos i hope you have a wonderful evening and indeed a good night <laughs>